This is Die Sporting Network. Work, work. DSL on YouTube is back with you here. Back at the senior JMS court here at the St. Francis Auditorium. And a matchup tonight in the debut of the DSN B More High School Basketball Showcase. Number one ranked St. Francis Academy Lady Panthers. This year so far, record of 1-0 against the Bishop McAmara Lady Mustangs. 20th ranked in the Watson post call for the WCAC. And tonight they'll be in a road maroon uniforms. St. Francis Lady Panthers will be in a home white. Should be a good one. And two of the better girls programs here in the area. Here in the state of Maryland. Should be an interesting one here. Both teams rank also nationally in the top 50. Tip off here. Tip off goes to the Lady Panthers first. Senior guard with the basketball for St. Francis now. The screen, Nia Reese. The ball kicks it back out. That's a three. Hits it. Up the court. Off the glass and in for Jackie Brown Turner. The outstanding guard for Bishop Agamer. 3 2. St. Francis here early. Doubled up. Reese has the basketball. That's a three from Pennick. Missed it. Tried to tap it. Offensive rebound is good. That one's blocked. On Clowns attack. Turned it over. Back to St. Francis. High inside. And that will go against Lady Mustangs. Get the ball back. Matthew. Inside the bump, that one spins in for Madison Scott. 4-3, McAmara. Very high pace environment so far. Great crowd for the Lady Panthers, the defending IAM champs. Reese inside, couldn't elevate enough. Missed it, she's fighting for the ball. The ball is turned over. And a jump ball. Mayor Reese credit not giving up on the play. Foul ball number 20, Holden Evans. Hope happens with our first basketball. Yeah, back over. The climbing. Little Pennick. Pennick off the screen. Again, she's gonna shoot three. That one missed. Ball in the hands of Hope Evans. Bump turns it over. Fast break three on two for the Panthers. Angel Reese with the two. Five four. Lady Panthers up by one. And a foul against. St. Francis and Nia. Foul call number 24, Nia Cloudy. Mustangs basketball. Scott back over the ninth out. And Evans has the ball at the top. Dribble, the double, ball was tipped slightly from downtown. That one is short. Offensive rebound for a brief moment, not there. Uh, she traveled. Traveling Some hands in there too. And the travel happened right before the hands got. And Bishop Magomed will inbound the basketball and Ashley Scott. Turner. 
Star Senior for Bishop Magna. Gets it over to Evans. Evans. Matthews. Too far for Turner to get. And a turnover. Panthers basketball. Major Riesel inbound for the Lady Panthers. One point game so far as Clyde has the basketball. Gives it up to Reese. Reese missed. And a rebound to Matthew for Bishop McAmel. She pushes the tempo inside all the way, but not there. Clyde with the rebound for St. Francis. She tried to go close to coast. That was thrown in here briefly by Moore and out of bounds. Bishop McAmel retains possession. So basketball. Taylor Gibson looked like she has come into the game. And over to Brown turn. Gets it back. Shot clock at 20. Scout. Over to Gibson briefly. That's a three from half out. That one is short. And the rebound goes over to Anir at the new. That one's a nail by Angel Reese. 7-4, St. Francis. That one's chipped. That one should stay with McAmer and it does. Mr. McAmey takes time right at the full two mark here in the first quarter. Team trying to establish themselves offensively. John Kell has moved into the position of Seton Keel. They close over the winner. Kell. Lady Patriots this Saturday. Exclusive covers of the second day of Surf versus Skins. And we got lady games coming at you and four male games. Al Kell and Weston. Polly and John Kell, ladies, will go at it. Switch their men's action, including the St. Francis men. The nightcap against St. Benedict Prep, ranked in the top ten. USA Today poll. We've seen them a year ago. Well, St. Joe's able to pull it off. So the fans will be able to. It's coming Saturday night. And we'll see it Sunday and the Monday also. Right now, Macamel trying to get it going offensively. Down three. That's a three. That was an air ball. Hot hustle and a shot clock violation. Second shot clock violation. Panthers basketball. Coach, Lady Panthers. Thirty-one and one record a year ago, losing in the Dick Sporting Goods semifinals in overtime. What a game that was! I watched it on ESPN. I did that game. It was a good game. Angel Reese, the young sophomore. Mr. Angel Gordon. Six, five. She's fouled. Four on the shot clock, though, however. Nope. Move for shot clock. Second team foul on the Lady Mustangs. That's a three. No. Offensive foul. Offensive foul on number 22. To Nero Hall. Mustangs basketball. And Scott will inbound. Lady Mustangs. Turns it over. Blocked by Scott out of bounds. St. Francis will retain. Panthers basketball. Found is taking a brief break. Little Lady Panthers. High to turn it over. Two on one break. Coast to coast. And 
Matthews. Got two. Wow, with two. It's a one point game, seven to six. Nice passing by the Lady Panthers. Reese inside and one. Angel Reese, Reese shooting one. Reese shooting the and one, short on it, offensive rebound. By the Lady Panthers, a fresh shot clock. That's a three, and that's a hero. Out of bounds. Back to Bishop Ackerman. Nine-six affair. Teams with good passing. Trying to come back in. Scott was double. And two, and Sonic got it in! A nine, eight game. Fast break, four, in there for her! Eleven, eight. Tamiro, four. and stepped out. Almost got the turnover. Stepped out of bounds. Hughes comes out, Clark comes back in. Nakamura. The session. Bell brought it back in. Scott over the Matthews. Bell. Scott to the basket and a foul. Two shot foul coming up. For a Madison Foul number one. Lady Mustang. And he misses. Madison Scott. Next Tuesday. The SMB Milwaukee Basketball Showcase. They're going to two venues. Zebra at Digital Harbor. As they take on Holly and Boys in the World Girls action. I'm Dan Merva. Not sure we're going to be at yet. We will let you know on our telecast on the church this Friday. And that's the SMB Milwaukee Showcase. Double and a blocking foul against Bishop Magnum. Foul ball number two, Aria Mathari. Mathari. Panthers. 14 foul on Magnum. Angel Reese will inbound the basketball. Cut it over, Reese with it. Travel. Traveling call. Ball back to Michael. Mustangs, basketball. One. 139 left here in the first quarter. Two up to Brown Turner for the lead. Hits it. Brown Turner with five. For the senior guard, wow. Bishop Agama. Cloudin trying to settle her troops down, and the ball is turned over. Agama with another good possession. Over the bell. That's the three. That hit. And Taylor Gibson. Taylor Gibson. Put Magamar up 17 11. Inside. That's the three. Hits it. Bennett with a big three. A three point game. Double. Back there, coast to coast. Ah, up the That's great. Over the reach. That's two points for her. That's on the court. McAvoy, she's got numbers. It's five. A foul is called. And two shots coming up. 
Taylor Gibson at the line is going to be shooting a pair of Fisher McAdoo. Got a little pace of action in this one so far. And these two, very good. Taylor Gibson Go program. shooting two. First shot. Got it. Stands the lead to one. Excuse me, stands the lead to two. 18 to 16. Second shot. Reese. Throw it up. End of the first quarter. And after one, a very good one here at St. Francis. The Lady Panthers on their home court down. By Deuce, 18 16. Bishop McAmara back with the second quarter here on DSN on YouTube after this. Second quarter about to get on the way. We're on the premiere of the DSNB More High School National Showcase. Third season. And we got a good ladies game here between Bishop McNamara and St. Francis. Lady. The Lady Mustangs. Seven of them, 18 points. Coming from their senior guard, Kia Brown Turner. That's the scout will inbound as getting everything right at the scores table. And we are back for official play. There you go. And through for Bishop McAmel was pushing that tempo for the Lady Mustang. Over the bow. Dash. Travel. Travel is the basketball. Move that other foot. And the ball back to St. Francis. Hughes will inbound over to Cloudy. The court back over to Angel Neese. Cloudy. That's a long distance three. That one is short. Offensive rebound to Reese. That one's high for her. She gets her own ball back. Still didn't get it. She gets one more chance. She's coming up to shoot two now. Oh, had that long distance three. And, uh, Reese, again, not giving up on the play, the young sophomore. Patrick is about to come in the game. That missed the first. Second shot here. That one rolls out too. Or three at the line so far for Angel Neese. Brown Turner, off the top, and the floater goes in. Jakea Brown Turner. 20 to 16. Cloudin. Pulled it backwards. Cloudin, she's going to shoot three. That one's high. Cloudin with a own rebound. Kicks it back to Pennick. Pennick with the floater off the glass. That's a miss. And Bishop McNamara with the rebound. Here comes Brown Turner. Off. Oh, three. Oh, look out. Bow. That one's short. The ball's everywhere. And then finally gets it. Reese to the basket. Shooting two. Hughes had it for a moment and then got it to Reese. Foul ball number 24. Madison Scott. The 16th foul on the Lady Mustangs. One more, and that'll put the Lady Panthers in the one on one. Missed it again. Tough times at the line for Reese. It's a four. The free throw so far. Yellow, yellow 
Second shot. That one spins in for There you go. Turner for three. That one's short. Rebound by Angel Nice. Three point game. Keys for three. That one's short. Brown Turner with the rebound. She brings it up. Gives it over to Matthew. Over the bow now. That's his three. Jay City. Brown Turner. Shot for three. Biggest lead for Bishop McNamara, six. And almost a turnover, backcourt violation. Backcourt violation. Mustangs basketball. Madison Scott's gonna take a breather. King is back in. And Gibson's gonna take a pause for the cause also. Toughest test for the Lady Panthers in their home quarter turnover. Hughes all by herself and misses the two. Offensive rebound is there. Canada foul for Patrick. She's coming up to shoot the end line. Still the basket. Foul call number five. Christina McPhail. Patrick trying to complete the three point attack. And, oh, goes out, out of bounds. Ball's gonna go to McAmel. Foul call number 10, Angel Reese. Oh, a foul Reese. on Angel Reese. Mustangs basketball. That's a 15 foul on St. Francis. Matthew with it, she brings it up. Brown again, missed it. Trying to hustle for the rebound. Not there. Hughes has it for St. Francis. Ball turned over. And the ball back. St. Francis. A lot of fun. Good defense also. Patrick almost didn't see that ball coming to her. Fowler has it. Hughes for three. That was high. And then the ball to the Lady Mustang. That's the three in the corner. That one is short. Oh, wow. Took the foul. Phil has shot the three. Offensive foul for the number one. Leave to King. King with the offensive foul. Panthers basketball. 453 left here in the first half. Sorry. Good one. Yeah, Francis always thinks things will take to come on out. Reese was blocked. Matthew with the rebound. Over to King. King puts it in for two. Time out by St. Francis. Time out, Panthers! Panthers down by six still. 25 19. Very tightly contested one here. Going. Check out DSN on YouTube. We did over 40 games a year ago. Check out some of the matches we had. We had some pretty good ones, some good playoff season matches. We will be bringing back our female girls week also in February, including, of course, Polly and Weston. That's always a good one between them teams. DSN on YouTube right now. Subscribe today. We got almost 130 subscribers. Every video comes up. They get it. They check it out. You can be the same today if you subscribe. DSN on YouTube. Your home for Maryland High School football. And right now, Lady Panthers, number one ranked team in the state here. They're in a tight one. Against Bishop Magama. Angel Reese. Taking the shot. 
Wilder. She is out there. Got a screen from Patrick. He's back over. Hughes travel. Three seconds. Three seconds ball. Mustang basketball. Mustangs will get it. Oh, uncertainty for the ladies. Bell inside. A nice defense to stop McPhail. And a foul against McAmey. That means some free throws should be shot. Foul call on number 13, Anaya Bell. It's Bell second. That's the team's ninth. And the one and one is in effect for St. Francis. Tanaya Patrick, she won a one. Here's the first. Patrick did a chance for another. Second shot here. Cut the lead to four. That one missed. Here comes McAmara. Matthew. Over to Madison Scott. Matthew, she's looking for McPhail. Handles for Matthew. But then she turns it over. And now an advantage for St. Francis. The side puts it in. What game? Go back up the court. Cloudin. Floater. Two turnovers from Agamara, St. Francis within one. Ball back. Calling violation. Panthers basketball. St. Francis down one, man. I'm taking a break. Here comes Cloudin. Double to Hughes. And the ball tapped out of bounds. Basketball. And Bishop McAmara will get the possession. Hope Evans back in to bring the ball up. Come back, take it away, take it away. Had to hold on. Evans back over to Scott. Yes, they're looking for Brown Turner. That's two points. Jakea Brown Turner. 27-24. Woo, real close to the line was Brown. Angel Reese, cross court to Hughes. Hughes puts it up, missed it. Angel Reese puts it in. Angel Reese. Here comes Brown Turner. Was turned over briefly. Evans over and side off the glass and in to Gibson. Gibson. 29-26. 2 10 left in the first half. Very contested contest. There's two very good lady programs. Start of the GSN Pima High School Basketball Showcase for the third season. Seven, six on the shot clock, Cloud and Hughes missed it. They turned it over to Scott. Here comes Bishop Agamemnon. Scott missed it coast to coast. A grab in the jersey. And a foul. And that should be the double double. The double foul double. Foul number 24, Madison Scott. Angel Reese shooting two. He's coming up. Shoot a pair. Fell shot. Got it. Two point game. And Brown Turner comes out. Matthew comes in. A little rest for the half. Both shots go in. 
One point game. 29 28. Evans. Puts it in. Missed it. Put that one up. Did not go in. Definitely got what she wanted. Angel Reese brings it up. Reese over to Hughes. And it's a hair. Matt Brown with the rebound. She's coming. And one. Coming up. For one more, man. Panic is coming back in. Jordan is taking a break. Miss. As Patrick gives it over to Angel Neese. 106 left in the first half. 31 28, Fisher McAmel. East. And a foul against McAmel. The leader, Scott's third. And again, number 24, Madison Scott. Reese hits the first. Brown turning back in. Fail comes out. Lane violation against St. Francis. 58.9 left in the first half. One possession game, 31-29. Fisher McElroy with the lead. They're looking for Brown Turner, no doubt. Kicks it over. That's a long distance shot. Tried to hit it off the glass, but no good there from Gibson. Here comes Cloudin up against Brown Turner. Angel Reese. The drive by Hughes off the glass and miss the shot clock is off. Traveling, and a traveling call. Panthers basketball. St. Francis is going to keep it on their end. They can tie with a two. Cloud in the rebound. Throws it over. That's a three. Short. The rebound over to McAmel. 14 seconds. Evans trying to pull it back. She do. Brown Turner was taking a shoot. Nick now good. He fouled. And one. I thought got a lane that opened up for her, and she took advantage of it. Foul number 23, Janaya Patrick. Three-point play. Puts the lead back to five. Four, three, Hughes. Missed it. Evans. Halftime. And for the St. Francis Lady Panthers, some opposition for them. Five point deficit here at the break. We're back in the second half. They're going to dance on YouTube after this.
third quarter. Second half has begun. A five point lead for the Lady Mustangs of Bishop McMahon, the maroon road jerseys against the white on number one rank here in the state of Maryland, the St. Francis Lady Panthers. Wilden with the basketball. Seven on the shot clock. Wilden over to Hughes for three. That one spins out. Offensive rebound. That one goes in. Wilden. Fast break from Akama. Oh, up and in for Brown Turner. That is against the Bishop McAmeyer coach, coming out of the coach's box. It's a warning to him. and brings it up for the Lady Panthers of St. Francis. This is one of their toughest tests at home in almost two seasons here. Inside, foul, I believe, might have been before the shot, and it is. Foul ball number one, Lea to King. It's King's Panthers first. basketball. Christian McAmey is first here in the second. Bottom we're inbound. Over the reach. That is a three by Pennick. Two point game as Brown Turner has the ball. Inside. King missed it. King gets on rebound. King second effort puts it in. Four point game. McNamara putting the defense on the Lady Panthers, making it hard for them to get a shot off to see which one of the players will get a good shot. Foster defense and head coach Frank Oliver. That one misses. From on to as Fowler and the Panthers had the ball down four. Defense along, gets the three, no good. That's out with the rebound. Evans is looking for the ball, back out coast to coast, missed it. Bell, counted it one more. And one. Now call number 12, Delisha Penny. Anaya Bell, shooting walk. In frustration by the lady. Panthers. Bell, shot spin out, but a Bishop rebound over to Evans. Fresh 30 for Bishop Magamon. Inside, that's a foul. Stop reaching. Stop reaching. Foul number five, Savon Hughes. Three, Hope Evans, shooting two. Evans shooting a pair. Six point game. And increase that lead for Bishop Magamon. Evans hits the first. Lockout. Second shot from Evans. 
Hits them both. Biggest lead for Bishop McNamara, eight. 42, 38. Cloudin. Throws it up. He's not able to keep it. Bishop McNamara. Evans. Brown Turner moving. Got the ball. Bell over to Brown Turner. Inside. Season two. Foul ball on the Cloud. On the Lady Panthers. It's the first round turner. Almost silent. Here at the Joni and John and Joni Crouch Gymnasium. Hits them both. 10 point lead by the Lady Mustangs of Bishop Akama, the WCAC. What a huge win this will be for them. Going back down to play likes of St. John. St. Francis, as that lead has moved. 10-5 run. Put the lead up to 10, 44-30. All right, check out the Flex Zone. Every Monday night here on Facebook Live, as well as on DSN, DSN Flex Zone Mondays, last couple of weeks. With one more here this month, and then we we we'll restart it back up in January. And now here on the first DSN B1 Brassball Showcase of this year, the number one Lady Panthers, and a hole at home by ten. Diesel and bound the clown. One, five, four, number two, Aaliyah McCowder. Panthers basketball. He's inbound. Cloudin. Round turner over to Hughes, back over to Cloudin again. Cloudin back over to Angel Reese. Inside the Panthers. Over to Hughes. That one spins out on Hughes. Brown, as he bounces with the rebound, over to Brown Turner, one-on-one, -on -one, high off the glass of mess, and a foul against Bishop Magama. Foul call number 11. 13 foul on the Lady Rant, on the Lady Rant. Panthers basketball. Keep the ball and then turn it over into the hands of Matthew. Over the bow. And they're gonna set it up. Evan has it now. And Bow Turner moving out the basketball. And now as Reese tried to double. And it is turned over then. Foul against the foul. Foul call on number 20, Hope Evans. That's it, it's on Evans. Panthers basketball. Reese will inbound. Robin brings it up. Panthers trying to get the offense going. Down 10. Reese. 
Offensive foul. Offensive foul call number 10, Angel Reese. Mustangs basketball. Foul. Over to Evans. Bell has it again. Inside. Push. 15 foul already on St. Frank. Foul call number 23 to Daniel Patrick. Mustangs basketball. Matthew Bell pulls out. Missed the floater. Rebound over to Pennant. Clouded now. Trying to get something going. Pennant. That's a three. That one short for Gooding. High. Matthew. Two points is in. 12 point lead. That was good. 46 34. Clouding pulls up, missed it. Reese with the rebound, coming up to shoot two. Two shot foul as the lady That one spins out. First roll. Second shot here. That one's in. Lee, 11. It's Evans. Back over to Scott. Brown Turner, and that spins out on her. That's it. A foul. Offensive foul from number 24. Cloud and I believe that's her third. Mustangs basketball. Lady Mustangs by 11. Already 16 fouls. Gotta be careful, one more foul. Over the rainbow, a miss. It's Gibson. It's Angel Reese. Has it. And a foul is coming. That's a 16 foul. Foul call number 24, Evans. Angel Reese shooting two. Shooting the pair. Getting to the point. Free throws are crucial. She was on the roll there for a little bit. Well, the eye is not kind. Second shot. And it spins out two. Scott gets it for Bishop McAmey. Here comes Evans. Kicks it over to Mather for three. That one's high. Offensive rebound by Scott. Puts it over to Brown Turn. Evans has it setting it up. 146 left here in the third quarter. Matthew back over. Madison Scott. That's a three. Missed it. Offensive rebound by Evans inside Brown Turner. Scott back over to Evans again. 18 on the shot clock. Ball out of bounds. Panthers basketball. St. Francis gets it. Almost a triple team there. Pennant shoots it. And air ball. Scott's got the rebound. Fast break up the court. Evans for three. That one is short. Brown Turner with the offensive rebound. That one didn't go. A fight. It's going to go to St. Francis. Panthers basketball. 55 seconds left here in the third quarter. Brown Turner going to take a quick end of the quarter rest. 
both teams are living the pressure they did in the first half. More St. Francis offensively. Inside, that one missed. Offensive rebound to Patrick. And she traveled. Traveling for Mustangs basketball. 41.4 left. Evans brings it up. Madison Scott back over to Evans. Over to King. Evans inside. Matthew. Ah, 17 seconds left. Angel Reese. Panic. For two. Hits it. Seconds left. Cuts the hole. Oh. Third quarter was defense ruled it. 46-37 is a nine point advantage for Bishop McAmara. Can they come in and get this huge win against St. Francis? The fourth quarter's coming. It's up next here on DSN on YouTube. After this. Fourth quarter, about to get underway. The premiere of the DSN B Morris National Showcase, and this one's been a good one. The number one Lady Panthers down nine coming into the fourth quarter. Can they come back? Huge win. Bishop McNamara is about to get this huge win. Inside and a foul. Brown Turner coming up to shoot two. Foul on number 10, Angel Reese. Reese with the foul call. Brown Turner hits the first. Puts the lead back to 10 again, 47 37. Second shot here. Hits them both. 48-37. Smith Clouton. Almost had the ball knocked over her knee. That's good by Gordon. Inside is Turner. Scott was able to get it back. That's our back over. Evans for three. That one's missed. Angel Reese grabs the rebound. Here comes Francis up the court. Reese, coast to coast, spins out on her. Rebound to Evans. Bishop McAmara, fast break, four on three. Kicks it over to Scott. Scott lost a handle. And a foul. Gordon coming to the line to shoot two. Gordon coming up to shoot the one and one. Anaya Gurdine, shooting one and one. Take your time, take your time. First shot, no. Angel Reese with the offensive rebound. Long arm, puts it in. Angel Reese. Cuts the lead to seven. Yes, indeed. That's a good one here, folks. That's a three from Turner Brown. Brown Turner, actually, excuse me. And Sai King counted it in one more. King shooting the end. Foul call number 33, Madison Hinton. Spins out. Angel Reese with the rebound. Over to Clouton. Got it. 
Restrepo, and a timeout. Ray Wise. Ray Wise to get that timeout. That was real close being a backcourt violation. I mean real close. 50-41. Next time you will see us is this coming Saturday, second day of the third, Shirts versus Skins at Coppin State University's gym. We got much for you, including Markel Lady Krugers against Polly Lady Engineer, and John K. Larry Patriots against the Western Dubs, and then <laughs> starting at 345, putting them Science Academy from Connecticut up against Mike Zahn. Brett, 530 Bishop Long Memorial Lions against John K. Patriots. We could see the debut of Manuel quickly. One and then Mount Carmel against Delaney at seven. Big one at 8.30. St. Benedict ranked in the top 10 in the USA Today poll against the St. Francis Panthers. Had to defeat the Gonzaga. If you've seen our video from Monday, boy, they got on a roll against Mount Carmel. And that's going to be a good one. Then out the shirts versus skins. Right now, the Lady Panthers themselves Trying not to suffer their first recollection defeat of the season. That's a three from Panic Hansen. A six point game. And the crowd starting to get in it. Evans setting it up with 16. 6.05 left in the game clock. Evans, Bell, that's a three for Manfow. That one's short, offensive rebound to Brown Turner. She puts it in off the pass. And then, 52-44. Pinnock, why not? In and out. Brown Turner brings it up for Makama. Timeout. Timeout, Mustang. Lady Mustangs take time. 5.34 left, 5.37, excuse me, left in this one. Oh my, tight one. There's the John and Joni Phelps Gymnasium here in St. Francis Academy campus. Check out BKD Dash TV, it's a website where sports lives. Right now, check out the NFL picks, as well as what have we learned lately throughout the end of every week, and of course, Tuesday afternoon quarterback, other special features as well in the NBA, college basketball, college football, sports media, and a little high school sports too. BKT-TV is a website with sports. Bell, inbound for the Lady, Lady Mustangs. Both teams trying to go 2-0 respectfully. Inside, that one missed. Tack. Rebound by King. She's on the floor. I think the ball will stay with Mustangs basketball. Round Turner, that was tapped out of bounds. Mustangs basketball. Straight with Bishop McAmeyer, 26 on the shot clock. Back over. Hands up. Happens has it now. Oh. And a walk. That foot move. Panthers basketball. Lady Panthers with it. We will, will inbound. We stumbled. High pass. Gordon has it. Pinnock. Inside and a trap. More. Mustang. Oh, he's trying to establish himself. Five oh nine left. Evans. 
This is McAmara with the basketball back over. Evans kicks it over to Brown Turner. Evans gets it back. Evans carries. Panthers basketball. Francis kicked the ball back. And Jarese over to near Cloud. Now Cloud trying to bring it up. Over to Gordon. Gordon. Mustangs basketball. I go over to the Lady Mustang. The shot hits the three is Brown Turner. Zakia Brown Turner for three. There you go. Lee back to 11. Lee for McAmel was 12. Angel Reese against Kane to the hoop. Foul is called. 18 foul on Bishop McAmel. Got not to shoot a pair here. Foul call on number one, Leah to Kane. Angel Reese shooting two. Here's the first. Second shot, got it. Time out, Panthers. St. Francis. It's a full time out, down by nine. Right, of course, you want to check myself tomorrow's die out on Facebook, tomorrow's analyst D on the Twitter, die spawning net. And on Instagram, lowercase D-M-A-R-U-S-D. Check us out here. You got any interviews or bookings for the Flex Zone also? Check out the Flex Zone at the Flex Zone 1 at Twitter or Instagram. As well as Facebook, the Flex Zone. Interesting one here, 413 left. And St. Francis tried to avoid their first regulation loss since 2016. Four thirteen away from pulling off the upset, getting the who's boost down in the WCAC. Right now, travel. Traveling call. Panthers basketball. St. Francis. Unlike in uh, pro basketball in college, the traveling call is called a lot in high school. Panic. Clouding. Puts it up and scores. Seven point game, 55. Drive, miss. Rebound to Kane. Spin move by Kane. And it rolls in for. McAmara back up by nine. 748 time. That's the Lady Panthers. And the step out. Mustang More like one of them tennis matches when his opponent will force the other into the month for sure. Turnovers has been a bit of a that's a foul. No, oh, stepped out. Out of bounds call. A lot of stepping out of bounds here when they last. Up the tunnel. Clowning brings it up. Over to Reese. 
Um, again. Screen. Clown for three. Hits it! minutes exactly right now. He's the section for Bishop Magama. Near two. Back over to Terrible call. Gibson. St. Francis gets it back with 249 left. Timeout by Bishop Magama. Game within reach. Number one, Lady Panthers. They're in the state. Nice press pole also. What a huge opportunity it is for Bishop Magma to get this one. They won 16 13 a year ago. You know, see. Andy Brown Turner is the real deal, folks. If you didn't believe it before the telecast, the whole she is now, no doubt about it. <laughs> After the shirt first skins, the next DSMB March Basel Showcase game. We will come to you with a boys game. Down Disco Harbor with Holly and Disco Harbor. Or we're going to head up to Marlboro, give your girls action some more. Institute of Notre Dame is actually right down the street from where we're at now. Francis up against Merva. We'll be coming at you. We will one of them two games next Tuesday. DSN on YouTube right now. St. Francis trying to hold on here. Trying to get back in it. They're down six. Bishop McNamara trying to hold on and pull off the offset. Be the first regulation loss for St. Francis since the 2015-16 season. Pinnock. Wilding now. Screen. Wilding. Offensive foul. Wilding violation. Mustangs basketball. 235 left. Two possession game, 57-51. Two inside missed it. Got the call coming up to C2. Foul call number 22 to Nero Moore. Moore with the foul. Aaliyah Mathalu shooting two. The shot in. Second shot, got it. 59 51. Crowden with it. Gordine. Pinnock for three. Hits him! Lead down to five now. Five two with it. Off the screen. Puts it up, missed it. Ball out of bounds, gonna go to St. Francis. No, the other way. They call the other way on Bristol Magamon. Mustangs, basketball. Line through inbound for Bristol Magamon. Brown Turner for three. Dagger! Dagger! She has done it all for Bishop Magamon on offense today. Comes Gordon. Pinnock again for three. Spins out. And a foul against St. Francis. The 151. Foul number 10, Angel Reese. Reese's four basketball. And two shots now. The double bonus is in effect. Actually, no, excuse me, the one and one is in effect. Actually, no, I am right. The double bonus is in effect. Professor McElmore. Leah 2 King, shooting 2. 
King shooting a pair. Round Turner with the dagger in the twenties and points. It's the first. For the number one St. Francis Lady Panthers. Takes a regular season defeat for the first time. 2015-16 season as well as a regulation defeat at home as well. Pennant for three. That one tipped short. Nice is fouled. He's coming up to shoot two. Foul call number one, Leo two, King. Angel Reese, shooting two. Gets him back in to King. Two heat free throws. First shot. Got it. Second shot in. Hi. Time out, Mustangs. Hi, right, Bishop McAmara. 99 seconds left in an eight point game. And a very good one. We started DSN, the Mice with National Showcase. And it's interesting to see what. Be drawing up. The defense got to get a stop. St. Francis, then you got to score. Cut this lead. Next time you will see us again this Saturday, day two of the shirt versus skins at Common State University. I'm going to give you a quick matchup to you on DSN on YouTube. All following the Maryland teams, please do not come with Lady Cougars and the Boy Cougars. Holly Engineers, John K, the Patriots, the ladies and the guys, the Western Ducks. St. Francis, Panthers as well. St. Benedict Prep Graves. They will, the two teams will have it at it to end out. Skins, if you remember last year, right here in the John and Joni. Throughout the gymnasium with the second shirt versus skin second day. Here comes Evans. Evans. Travel. And travel. Papers. Basketball. St. Francis got one thing they needed. Now they got to get it on offense. Clouding. <laughs> Gordine. Double, Patrick, Gordine, they gotta get some offense, going in a hurry. Clouding, Gordine from downtown. That one is short, the rebound, the man foul. And a foul. Two shot foul. Foul call number 22 to Nero Moore. Moore with the foul call. Foul hits the first. Down in Forestville, Maryland, Bishop McAmara is. Boys got a big win against Mark Camel Saturday. The Charm City Challenge. And now the ladies are a minute and 14 away from getting a huge win against the top wing. That one is wild. Counted in one more. Two basket. Four more. Two more. Now call number 20, Hope Evans. Two more. Shooting one. More shooting the end one. Both 
both teams at 10,000 over the double bonus in the back. Oh. Jesus. 66-59. Evans. We're going to take some time. One minute left. Evans. Don't want to foul, but you got to get a stop. Over to Brown. And she is Brown. Brown Turner coming up to shoot two. A lot of time went off that clock. Now part of number 22, Tanira Moore. Moore's fourth now. Pound him up. Jaquia Brown-Turner, shooting two. Brown-Turner with a pair here. Put the lead back to nine, and she hits them both. Hits the first. Very efficient at the line is Bishop McNamara, Lady Panthers. Excuse me, not Lady Panthers. Missed the first, got on rebound. Traveling travel. ball. Panthers basketball. Uh, the old Tom Teddy Jinx, Jinx the uh, Lady Mustangs there. We got down the seconds. Ball got to move up the court. Angel Reese over the panic. Got to get a shot off. Problem for three. That one is short. Rebound by Angel Reese. Puts it up, missed it too. And a rebound. Foul on Matha. 28.5, shot clock's off. Foul call number 24, Leah Cloudy. Aliyah Mathauru, shooting two. Mathauru hits the first. Take the lead back to nine. Ten point game, be a wrap. Second shot. Hits them both. Angel Reese. Bound it in. Over the Cloudin. Cloudin, coast to coast. Oh, that one spins off. Miss. Rebound by Matt Bow. And a foul. That's it for her. Huge win for Bishop McNamara. Ranked in the top 20 in the Washington Post. They're going to move up the ranking. Aaliyah Down in WCAC. The Lady Panthers. The streak wasn't the last in the regular season forever. But it comes to an end tonight at home. As Matha hits them both. A tough game, but Brown Turner just too much as Penick shoots the three. That one is short. Brown. Bell will get it. That will do it. Bishop McAmara comes in. The ball is And Panthers 59. 71. St. Francis Academy thanks you for your support, and we look forward to seeing you at our next home game, December 20th, against Theodore Roosevelt, right here at St. Francis Academy, 6 p.m. And please drive home. We say so long to you here on DSN on YouTube. I'm Demar Stein. We see you at the Shirts and Skins this Saturday. On DSN on YouTube, then the video will be up late Saturday night into Sunday and Monday. So long, folks. We will see you then this Saturday. The Lady Panthers go down at home. Bishop McNamara down score 71 to 59. I'm on side with you in the Diaspora Network saying so long. This is Stork Moments from the last regular season game from the historic Seton Keogh High School. The biggest wave for St. Vincent Pilate. Bacon puts it in.
1,000 points. Kia Bacon. Leah Bacon with a 1,000 points. This is Die Sporting Network.